Uh, hi mateys, want to welcome you guys back to some more Mass Effect Andromeda. You know, I'm still saying that. I'm, I'm still saying Andromeda with like, um, I'm not sure if that's right, but anyway, guys, here we go. Let me talk to this guy first. That's not what I wanted to do. Seems like we're forever racing, but there's always time to check out new toys, useful ones. Always game for new toys. This makes use of old ones, like anything you grabbed on Habitat 7. Raw minerals, tech, doesn't matter. The research station will strip that stuff down and give you options. We're on our own, for everybody else. That's what Pathfinder means now. Yeah, well, everybody should be so lucky. This tech is aces. If the best we get is what we make, still the best. Check it out. Okay. You know what? I think we're gonna go with develop. Yep, I think this is more important. I think it is. Oh yeah, this is more important to me. Let me check out the other one though. Nope. Hold on. You know what? I don't know which one. I think I'm going to go with... I'm still going to go with the first one. Well, I don't even think I have to pick. Let me just... Oh, I thought I had a pick. Never mind. Never mind, guys. You know what? I'll do this later. Let me just check out this place. Departure trajectory locked, Nexus Control. Ah, time for introductions. You must be Ryder, Gallo Jaff. A pleasure to be here, and to meet you, of course. I'll be piloting the Tempest at your word. Quite the ship, but it'll take a Pathfinder's guidance to see us through Helios. I'm new to this. Being a Pathfinder running a ship? You'll be fine. As for the ship, I can help. I knew the Tempest when she was a blueprint. I was test pilot for the Tempest's early prototypes. I admit, I'm itching to see how she performs out here. So how do I... The console syncs with your implant. Just swipe, touch a destination here, and the nav system calculates everything. Very efficient. It was optimized. For a Pathfinder. Everything's secure, if you're ready. Is anyone ready for something this big? I guess we have to be. All right. Excuse me. Excuse me. Command access is transferring successfully. Uh, science and monitoring stations look fine. Lexi's reporting in. Helm is green. Gill reports the drive core is online. This is it, Ryder. The Tempest is yours. Unless you've got something to say for the log. Things seem bad. But we've already beaten the odds. And we'll beat them again. You know it. I know it. So let's show them what we got. You gotta be positive for this. This is the Tempest. Ident 2527. Prepping to depart. Departure vector verified, Tempest. 
Godspeed, Pathfinder. Okay, okay, here we go. What would have been our Habitat 1? Two failed outposts put an end to that idea. Maybe we can turn things around. Calo, take us in. So I'm here. I guess we'll go here. This is where we're supposed to go. Andromeda Initiative Habitat 1, designated EOS. It was supposed to be an easy first step, until no one else showed and we got clobbered. Twice. Why has Sam altered frequency detection? What are we hearing, Sam? There is a signal, Pathfinder. I recommend an immediate examination of EOS. What the hell? A mirror of the signal on Habitat 7. Possible atmospheric manipulation. Is that possible? We'll find out. If it is like Habitat 7, no doubt we'll run into the cat. I was about to say. I thought you were just supposed to scan the... Um... Just scan the planet, but I guess we're go gonna go inside. Anyway, let me just see what kind of what I, I could just. Oh, could I pick? All right. All right, all right. I think. I think I'm just gonna go with this one right here. All right, then. Don't not pick it. What the hell? You know what? Why is it not letting me do this? I'm gonna go with this one. I have to go with this one, but... Alright then. Whatever then. I'm just gonna go with the flow. Hope we're all that ready. Callow, all right? Integrating search area from Sam. How he pulled that mystery signal through the storms, I have no idea. Multi-sensory neural collation. Amazing. Factory fresh across the board. Spinning up the compensators. You're already tuning the displays. We'll get a better read on this pass than the Nexus has had in months. <laughs> I said a lot of people have their hopes pinned on us. They gave up on Eos. I can't blame them. Expected a golden world, instead they saw their friends die. Never know how that'll affect. Uh, sorry. You okay? I've got the training. People. The tools. We can do this. Pathfinder, the Tempest checks out. We're good. Take us down. You have no idea how long I've wanted a Pathfinder to say that. Core is hot. Shields holding, adjusting entry. We got this, right? Set us down at this nav point.
<laughs> what the fuck? His face. How to even start? Report state this planet suffers deadly storm. I, I kind of just got me. <laughs> Whew. EO's deployment was incomplete due to environmental hazards and ultimately hostile encounters. Plus, no pathfinder. Doors getting emergency power, but it's code locked. Site one issued individual security. The hell? Each outpost self-organizes and sets its own protocol. Just say we can't open it without codes. We can't open it without codes. Oh, okay, then I guess I can't get inside. They didn't have a pathfinder. They do now. We'll make Eos home. Find a code to access... Okay. So we gotta find a code first. What the hell is this? We suffered our first death. Oh. Storm came out of nowhere. Lockley tried to cover our crops. Lost his footing. Got swept away. His wife is still in cryo. Maybe by the time they wake her up, I'll know what to say. Got a code lock key. That should help get us in. Well, that was easy. I really do like this. I like doing this. It's so fun. If only I could do this in real life. I got a partial log, but I can't turn on the antenna. Something's blocking the power. A remote lock is active. The interference originates from a nearby power relay tower. So we're not the only ones interested in what happened here. Let's check out this relay tower. Okay then. Let me check out this place right here. Main door had power, but not the interior doors? Full functionality would require an active power. Or relay. I'll take everything. That means the antenna's out of power, too. Like the console said. Let's head to the relay station. Wait, hold up. So I missed something here. Yep, let me see. I'm gonna let you guys read this or pause it. You guys can pause it if you guys like. I'm just gonna skim through this. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold up. Oh, I thought I missed something. Never mind. Maybe I'm supposed to scan something in this room. Research data pathfinder. If you continue to scan and collect this data, we can utilize it to develop new technologies and upgrades for equipment such as your weapons and armor. This is the only thing I could think of. Maybe just scan everything. Maybe I'll find something. I just checked this. What the hell? Sandstorms, radiation. What the hell was Addison thinking, sending us here? Eos might have looked great back in the Milky Way, but up close, it's a hellscape. Farthingale's on my case to stay positive. Put on a brave face for the rest of the team, but I can't shake the feeling that I'm gonna die out here. How about this? I don't know, I scanned everything. There has to be something. I already scanned this. I already scanned it. I don't know what... I already took everything from here. Let me see. Maybe I could go outside. I'm just gonna try to scan everything, maybe something will pop up.
Look at this place. It's a wasteland. The radiation in Eos's atmosphere makes it difficult to cultivate life. Radiation? Our suits protect against that, right? Site 1 contains shield masts to dampen the brunt of contamination. But if we went outside Site 1's perimeter? That would not be advised. So, I guess what I thought we were just supposed to investigate that place, but I think we're supposed to investigate the whole place. Let's go check it out. I kind of want to see what's inside here. This is for purifying water. That's what a few hundred tons of steel and the storms. What the hell? Oh, I like doing that. I gotta say, I like the fact that you could just... I like this part, you, you could just explore everything. But I feel like... I feel like I'm missing something. I don't know what it is. I guess I'm just gonna follow that little icon. Structure up ahead. Sam? It fits the profile of a power relay station, Pathfinder. It's inoperable, Pathfinder. Too long in this environment without power. We didn't expect this kind of environment. Who could? What the hell? Oh. Pathfinder, that door is locked. Until power is restored, there is no way to unlock it or gain entry to these buildings. I guess we're just supposed to restore the power so we can actually go inside. I mean, or maybe I could find another way in. Huh. Guess that ship wasn't kept then. They don't knock. There are people here? We thought everyone left was gone. Of course you did. Now shove off. Find your own salvage. This spot's taken. I'm not a salvager. I'm a pathfinder. We've come to fix all this. Call me Clancy. Pathfinder, huh? Like that changes much. The Nexus just can't let Eos go, can it? However much it fails down here. I'm tracking a signal that will help Eos. I only need power for the antenna. Look. I cut the power for a reason. The Ket are patrolling today. You turn the power relay back on, they'll know there's a juicy target alive down here. Help me with the power relay, and I'll take care of the Ket. You're crazy. Though well, maybe it's a good crazy. Okay, I'll enable the generators out there. You want to poke the tiger, it's on you. Hi right, guys. I'm going to stop right here. I want to thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. We start the generators. It looks like we just got to activate the generators and clear the atmosphere radiation. So I'm going to do that in the next video. So I'll catch you guys later.